Hello, uh, today I'm going to show you how you can download a file directly from its URL using C Sharp in Visual Studio 2008. Uh, I just created a very simple little GUI interface with a text box and a download button just to make things um, a lot easier. Just going to double click this download, click the download button to begin writing the code. Um, the first thing we have to do is we have to uh, add a using statement in order that we can use uh, the web client let's call it WC and um, there are two different ways you can download a file you can either call the download file or the download file async the uh, differences between uh, the two is that download file will freeze your program until the download is actually finished uh, while the download file uh, async doesn't actually block the main thread, so uh, you'll be you'll uh, still be able to interact with the various elements of your program. So that's why I'm going to choose this one since it's a much better choice. And then we have to pass it a what's known as a URI, which is a URL address. So we're going to create one. It's called image URL, and we have to pass it a string and I'm going to give it the logo of my website so we give it the URI address which is image URL and then we give it uh, a file name so you can do like C users like your username desktop image.jpg this obviously won't work since uh, my name isn't your username but it will save it, it will create it and if you just do image.jpg uh, it'll just save it to wherever uh, the source of your program is so uh, and that's really all you need it's very simple um, so in order to add just like a little bit of variation to this. Um, I'm going to create an event handler that will uh, display a message once the download is completed. So we call the download, we create a new event download file completed. Press the tab to have a, a nice little uh, auto creation thing that Visual Studio does. We're going to name the method uh, file completed. and then let's go ahead and create that and and I believe we have to do the object sender and async completed event args e there we go alright so that all uh, and uh, no errors there and we're just going to show a message box okay build it no errors um, actually let's go ahead and change this to the text of the text box I forgot I had a text box there All right. Um, here's our little form. Let's put in the URL. Download. Download completed. Good job. And if I look in my source, uh, I will find the image just sitting there. Projects. Windows form. Windows form. Bin debug image dot jpeg and you see there is the preview of the image and that is all in this tutorial how to download a program or how to download a file with C sharp um, if you'd like to have any other tutorials make sure to leave a comment on my video and make sure to subscribe to my videos also make sure to visit my website and my forums which is in my description this is Quackware signing out